I love the film. I love the romance. That's so sweet. The intimacy and closeness, I love it too. I love it and it makes me think about my first love and my first relationship. If you could go back in time, what would you tell yourself now? Going back. That everything's going to be okay. And that this, this too shall pass. I love that. I think that's so important too because there's a really strong young female demographic that watches this film. What would you say to all those girls out there watching this movie? Um, to trust yourself and believe in yourself because nobody's going to believe in you like you believe in you. That's so powerful. I love that. Now onto the fun stuff. Truth or dare? Oh, dare. I dare, I dare you to take off your shoes and run up and down the carpet. I'm going to see who's actually going to do it. Are you going to do it? <laughs> I love you. You're the, she is the baddest girl on the carpet. She took the dare. Ladies and gentlemen, she took the I dare. took the dare. Took off the Dior shoes. Having my child. She took the dare. She took off the shoes. You're literally my idol right now. She's my idol. Oh, wow. But you did like that breather, didn't you? Huh? You like that little breather with your toes, didn't you? I know, it was it was nice, it was a little break. I was like, this is a great opportunity to take my shoes off. Absolutely. So one of the things I love about this is a lot of self-reflection when you're younger. What would you say you've learned about yourself from that age when you started until now? That I'm resilient and that you know you can you fall down and you get back up and regardless of what that's just like what you do you know and that's the biggest thing I learned about myself is that no matter how hard I fall or how far I can still always get back up as long as I believe in myself and what I've learned is three minutes is that you really enjoy life you live presently and you take a dare yes awesome yes I do I'm very present and how much are you like your real character in real life um not really at all <laughs> I'm more like super like quaint and quiet I like didn't go to my first party until I was like 18. I didn't go out for my first time until I was like 23. So I'm very much not like a party girl. I could count probably on two hands how many like actual parties I've been to. Good for you. I can tell you have an amazing head on your shoulders and congratulations. I love talking to you. Thank you. I love talking to you too. And I thank God you took off your shoes. She's the first person to take the dare. Really? Everyone else said yes and then they're like, okay, truth. Oh, that's so funny.